Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Isle of Rebirth. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and as you can see, I've got the uh, Curse Skull number 15, and we have this lovely situation to deal with. Oh boy. Dang it. It sucks that being cursed, or jinxed, or whatever you want to call it, affects both A and B, but it also saves me the trouble of having to remember which one does which. Uh... There we go. Now I just have to go back. There we go. Notice that these things don't even have knockback, do they? That is kind of odd, really, because it seems odd to have an enemy that doesn't have knockback. And whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, uh, technically this is a take two because of that. And me losing my shield, that's not, I'm not going to let that happen. That is not this early in things. Okay, so what I need to do is go up here. Haha. -ha. And that was where the first what the first key was for. And it, it was to actually let me into this phase of things. Now I have a suspicion as to what the boss is going to be here. I'm wondering if I'm gonna end up being proven wrong. What's the point of using the hammer if I'm... Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, there's pots there to be had. So I am going to take full advantage. Better than nothing. And that's the second key. And the other three are used for this passageway. And with the handy switch that's right here, I have a nice shortcut. Oh dear. But doesn't really matter what damage I took because there's a torch right here. So... So you've come. Right on time. Were you really expecting Ganon? Kinda. I'm afraid he's already been revived and then disposed of. Oh my. All Lord Venser needed with Ganon was his Triforce of Power. Ganon himself was an insignificant insect in his plan. Oh my goodness, what an insult. So now you're presented with a choice. You can either willingly relinquish your Triforce of Courage, or I can kill you and take it. What? You really think you can stand against me? Foolish child, you must think you're on top of the world after saving Zelda. Who do you think it was who organized everything that led you succeed? Me? I'll enjoy watching the life leave your eyes, hero. Fallen Angel, Lumen. Oh, and they explode! Um, thoughts. Do arrows hurt you? No. Does... Yes, magic does hurt you. It's the same strength as my sword. And it's... Okay, that works. Probably better than it should. Oh boy, I can only imagine how many phases you're going to have. I'm... Well, I wonder what 
that noise is. Uh oh, she's moving. Oh dear. I'm not, I wasn't going to use my potion there because I was going to save here and then use my potions next time. And I'm also going to refill my magic because I, yeah, that's kind of a thing I want to do. Okay. And those do two hearts apiece. So those the the fireballs there aren't so much on a timer. As they are they just blow up after a certain number of hits. And it seems, I think those spike balls do too. They just move a lot slower. Ah. Dang it. Why is my timing so bad? Oh, jeez. Whoa! Oh, my. Aren't you? If you're just gonna fly around and do nothing, I'm not gonna argue. Woo! <laughs> Dodging skills! Oh dear. Oh dear. Whoa, okay, you're, so now you're not even showing up, but hey, I guess you're near death anyway. Might as well pull out all the tricks, eh? So that's our, f our first heart on this on the third row. What the heck is hap going to happen now? Hello, Vencer. I must say I'm genuinely surprised you made it past Lumen, but you're too late. I've taken Ganon's Triforce of Power. You've been beyond helpful, you know. You took the bait and brought the Triforce Zelda Shattered back together without thinking twice. I had my doubts about whether you could save your princess from the dragon, and I've never been happier to be wrong. However, this is where your usefulness has come to an end. I'm going to dispose of you and take your Triforce of Courage. Says you, it's time for you to join Ganon in the afterlife. Farewell, hero. Triforce Usurper, Vencer. Oh, crap, I have to fight you again. And this time, I don't have potions to use. And I'm about to die.
Do you still- Why do you still resist? It's hopeless. You cannot possibly stand against my two Triforce pieces with only one. I'm eager to add yours to my collection after I send you per- to personally apologize to your ancestors for your failure. What? Oh, nice one! Thank you! Just learn the true nature of Venser's plan. I should never have sent you after him in the gate. At least not yet. As you know, Venser only revived Ganon to obtain his Triforce of Power. Luckily for us, he wasn't able to take your Triforce of Courage yet. Thank goodness. Gathering the Triforce is only a means to an end for him. You see, he isn't of this world. He was banished to our realm thousands of years ago. In his own realm, he was feared as a false god. He nearly destroyed our world, frantically looking for a way to go home. However, he was defeated by the combined might of the Seven Sages. However, while his body was destroyed in the battle, his spirit was far too strong to perish. He possessed the body of one of the Sages. With his body and a second wind, he was able to slay the rest of the Sages. After this battle, he accepted the futility of trying to go home. So Venser bided his time for thousands of years, preserving his temporary body with his still considerable power. Now he found a method of returning to his old self. He aims to reunite the Triforce and have it grant his wish to be reborn. If this happens, he will finally have the power to break the dimensional seal that binds him here and return home. We cannot allow this. Venser's home realm doesn't have any natural doors to ours. Opening a gateway would rip open the fabric of the universe. Yeah, that's kind of bad. Naturally, this would completely destroy our world and many others along the way. We must stop him and reclaim the Triforce pieces. There's a way to get the strength you need to face him, though. In this realm, there are three gems blessed by the goddesses. If you can collect these, you might be able to get the goddesses to bless your sword with the power to slay a false god. He's waiting for you to come to him in the prismatic gate, so time is on our side and we can prepare. Good luck, Link. Where the heck am I? Resting in the desert wasteland to the northwest. Oh! Haha! I know where that is! Anything else here? Okay, however, poor working conditions coupled with the lack of supplies from the Wizrobe clan that employed us caused me to defect to the resistance. The Wizrobes had us start building a biomechanical weapon, but were oddly more concerned with energy supplies. However, the project was abandoned and is probably still sitting in the containment chamber inside the facility. Aha! Well, that's good. If you destroy the abomination that I created, you can keep the jewel as a reward. The facility lies to the east in the volcano region. Oh! Okay. Well, that's nice. So where the heck am I? I reiterate, where the heck am I? The Glim Sanctuary. <laughs> Wait, what was the... Corrupted government hunger all plagued the surface. Yeah. Let me guess. Bomb. Yes, bomb. <laughs> oh, my. And wasted money. And I'm... Are those uh, supposed to be portraits or something? Hmm. I, w I thought so. I thought so. Uh, so I'm wondering what's what this place... Where this place is, really. Let me guess. That's not really something I ha can do. No. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Well, thankfully, I have such a map, and oh. So this was the exit, and where... Oh, this is where I am, okay. 
Alright. So, what else is there for me to gain here? Like information, perhaps. <laughs> the skull shaped rock. Uh huh. Gee, I wonder what that might be. Well, and there's a shop. Well, so we'll see if there's a potion for sale. Yes, there is. And that's an expensive looking hammer. But first things first, potions. Having potions is kind of the priority at the moment, especially since I can't actually afford that hammer, no way, no how. At least not yet. I, I still remember where that uh, upgrade is, I just don't know how to get it just now. And I get most of my money back anyway. Glad I went to the shop first. Uh... Okay. Really now? And an, an inscription? Well, let's talk to you first. Bring forth the gems three and be blessed by the goddesses. Only then will you be deemed worthy. Okay. Yeah. The lesser of two evils, I suppose. And a uh, piece of heart. And that brings me up to three. Good. Uh, so where... Well, this looks like it connects through to here. Aha. Uh -huh. Lack of high-end explosives, huh? Well, I think I might be able to assist in that. Uh, this, and this will connect back around to there. Haha. Uh -huh. Good thing I had those. I probably end up wanting to buy a couple more. But I want to check this path out first. See what just the what the scope of this place is. Hmm. Hmm. And I actually recognize the music. I believe this is a uh, lower Rabinaster the low town from Final Fantasy 12 if memory serves I'm a little surprised to see that of all things in here uh, let's check out this way first let's see, what was the item I had oh yeah a Goron bracelet that I a necklace or whatever killed by a guy stuck in a corner what and, oh jeez. Training grounds. Didn't expect to see another arena. Price of admission is, oh boy, how expensive is this place? Oh, uh, so is this where I get the wallet upgrade? I thought I saw one up top before. Huh. Well, at least the money's not going to waste now. Uh, might as well see what the price is. A hundred. But that wallet is definitely something I want to have. Okay. That's definitely something I want to look into, but I want to check out the rest of this place first. 
Yeah, cuz that thing is not there for no reason. To use an odd bit of sentence structure. Uh and we got the info again. Oh. Thanks to some cosmic issues regarding info shops, I have to give you hints for free now. Okay. Not sure why, what, what the heck's going on there, but I'll take what I can get. Its thick metal chassis protects it, and orbiting probes protects it from most of your items. However, once vulnerable, a gust of wind might create enough static electricity to slow it down temporarily. Okay, getting hit by this foe will disable your weapons for a few seconds, so prioritize evasion over aggression. Your foe will coat itself in dark energy. One of your newly acquired items may be able to shed some light on the situation. And also help with a certain other thing that I haven't been able to do yet. And it's only now that I realize I don't think I got actually got any items out of level 9. D turns out I don't think anything was required, but uh, yeah, that was a thing. Uh, okay, there is a heart piece that I want and I can freely get, which would make heart container number 22. Hooray! So I hear there's a new arena, yeah. Yeah, considering the boss of the last one. Yeah, I have reason to be worried. Those things definitely are no joke. And another teleporter thing, or what? I have no idea what the heck that is. Uh. Okay. And where is your boss, pray tell? Uh, I think I've explored this entire place. <laughs> uh, so where... Well, I know the security thing to the volcano region got opened up. I... am not sure what that means. But apparently I can do stuff over here now. I guess. But what was the other thing? It was it had to have been somewhere up here. Oh, right, I can go that way now. And since... Since this one was mentioned first, I'm probably going to go here first. I don't know if I have a... There's a specific order I need to do things in. I probably need to get the first two... Get those two first. Because then... Uh, let's see, where was it again? I think there was something over here that... It was something somewhere. Maybe it was up here or something that I needed the... Uh, needed to have two gems to make way for the third. Actually, no, it was on the way to level 8. That's where it was. It was in Light World. So, uh, I guess first things first, I'm going to at least try the arena. And from there, I guess I'll head up to the northwest and see what I can do there. So until then, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.